everyone i hope you all are doing good in today's video we are going to be talking about the recent topic which is order report the order report is basically a report which is generated to know about the order summary of the account you can see the total number of orders with a particular date or you can choose the format of your choice to download the accounts order report secondly if you are getting the returns then to review the ret uh, summary of the returns you can download the order report so without further delay we'll start our topic to reach the order report dashboard so first of all from amazon dashboard click to the um, amazon seller central button and select the order report from the order drop down menu i'm going to select the order report so when you click on the order report then you will go to the page of the order report menu which is dashboard for order report so first of all from the very first option is new orders which will show the data for the, all the new orders which we have received in recent days here are the uh, some filters which we can apply to request the order report first of all um we will we will apply the date range which is maximum for the 90 days we can apply the, this filter uh, for example i will apply the last 15 days filter and request the report which will be generated in some time it uh, gives you the notification to for the report which is generated and being proceed and it can take up to 45 minutes for the time of your request to generate this report okay the next topic dashboard which is uh, schedule report setting and in schedule report you can schedule a report for the for every day which you want to, uh, your report to be downloaded uh, you can uh, click for every hour you can click for 4 uh, hours or 8 hours and uh, every 15 minutes for example if you want your report to be downloaded for every 15 minutes you can click on every 15 minute option and uh, schedule Uh, here i can uh, i have already scheduled my report and uh, that's why it is uh, showing you the option of reschedule so i can reschedule my report and um, the setting is applied now it will be um, downloaded the report after 15 minutes so basically um, there is another option which is, which shows that you can download your report daily at now this is the option of daily at you can select the time frame which is 1 am to maximum of time you are uh, uh, given for your account which is for example i select the 1 pm so whenever i select a reschedule option uh, my report will be downloaded at 1 pm daily so this is the uh, very first option which is new orders report now we will wait for the report to be downloaded now the second option is unshipped orders I'm going to click on unshipped orders. We are here in the dashboard of the unshipped orders. We can request the report for the unshipped orders we have not shipped to the customers yet. Here you can see there is no filter to be uh, set for the unshipped reports because the unshipped orders are the very recent orders which have not been unshipped to the customer. If I am requesting this report, then it will take some time to be downloaded, and then uh, we will see the report for the unshipped orders. um here you can see that um, request is submitted but not ready and uh, uh, the already existing reports which are which are showing that no new orders that means that the uh, all the orders are shipped to the customers and there is no unshipped orders available in this uh, option okay the third one option is end of the day forms end of the day forms basically um, can be generated at the carrier and warehouse level you can download the last 30 generated forms Here in my account, the option is showing that no shipments are avail available to generate the end of the day form. So we will not proceed it further, and we'll uh, move towards the very first option, which is new orders report. Now the uh, report which have which we already uh, requested to be generated is ready to download. I am going to click on the download button, and the report is going to be downloaded first. So the report is here. uh basically it is in uh, text format so it is very um, you know tough to understand the text format so i'll have to op i'll have to copy this uh, format and then paste it in the excel sheet so here in excel sheet we will paste the copied text and then it will be easy to understand all the uh, columns for the order report so first of all it is showing the order id which is very uh, necessary to uh, try can i order the next one is uh, order item id the first uh, the other one is uh, purchase date on which date the order was placed and the next one is uh, payment date on which date the payment was done 
and after that the buyer name and buyer email like the all the contact information of the buyer and all the you can see all the information which is uh, related to the order is already mentioned in this uh, new order report so you can uh, track easily all the information for the orders order in this order report and um, keep the track of your data of the every order so all the options are covered in this topic you can easily download the report and keep the data in all the new and shipped and unshipped orders so that's all from the orders report dashboard if you have any questions please write down in the comment section and also please like subscribe and share this video thanks bye bye